Hi guys, it's Amy from Frugal Cookie Blog back with an update on my project plan that I started in January of this year. I can't believe how quickly the time has gone. It is now the 2nd of April when I'm filming this. And I think I've done fairly well. I haven't finished everything, but I will just go through and show you what I've done. So, yeah, I very, only very just got rid of this. So, like, it's gone. Um, sort of the back end of last week, I managed to finish this. This lasted for ages. It's 240 mils um, of vitamin C cleanser. It's quite a stringent face wash. And... You know, towards the end, I was using this every single day in the shower and just lasted and lasted and lasted. So I suppose that's a good thing, you know, when a product lasts so long. Um, but it just got to the point where I couldn't wait to get rid of it. And vitamin C doesn't tend to last that long. So the fact that I've had this product probably over a year now, um, it's probably not as potent as it should be. But I did find it did a good job in making my face feel really sort of clean and tight and, yeah, clean. So that's good. Next, I've got this Sanctuary Spa um, Youth Boosting Facial Warming Microabrasion Polish. I've got another one of these in the cupboard, so I just wanted to use this one up, basically. It's, um, it's a face scrub. When you put it on your face, it does heat up. Which is quite nice 100 mils in this bottle i mean it doesn't seem like much but it's not a product that i'd use every day it's a product that i'd use once a week if i remember this was one of the first things that i used up in project pan to be honest i didn't have a lot left in that next i put this in a cupboard and i forgot about it so i'm gonna have to carry this one forward it's useful to take on holiday and stuff so i'm not gonna bin it but um I didn't even try with that one, so sorry about that. I wasn't sure when I was going to get to the end of this, and oh, truth be told, I used the last pump of this this morning, so I'm at the end of it now, which is great. Um, I didn't buy this, I got this as like a free gift with something. Um, but yeah, I used it, it was okay, light reflecting SPF 15, not something I'm going to rave about. But I enjoyed using it. It was alright. Um, another product that I haven't used up, unfortunately. I think I'm about here in the bottle. Basically, I forgot all about this one. And I used a different serum. Um, I used another one up, but forgot about this. So, I'm going to continue using that on a daily basis anyway. Um, this one is finished. Um, this is the 2.5% retinol um, serum and I have successfully finished that one. That was literally a couple of days ago that I got to the end of that one. Um, uh, next, I've got this Be Good Honey and Camelina Facial Exfoliator. I really like products with honey in. I know it's not sort of vegan and everything else, but they always smell nice and it did nice things. It was a nice scrub. It's not... Yeah, I, I don't know if I'd go out and buy it straight away, but if I saw it in a shop, I, I probably would pick it up, to be honest. It's not something that I'll go out looking for, but if I find it, then I probably would make a purchase. Uh, next, I've got this Rimmel Wake Me Up Anti-Fatigue Foundation Skin Brightening. I have got to the end of that. It was okay. Looks a little bit dry in places when I use this, but all right as a foundation. I just need to use it with a sort of dampened beauty blender to make it that little bit more moisturising to look at. There is another item and I've lost it. Basically, I have used it and I think I've probably just chucked it straight in the bin. It was a Dior uh, like face makeup remover. I used that a couple of weeks ago, so I must have literally just chucked it in the, big, the bin and forgotten about this project. And then finally, I have got this Urban Decay Perversion Mascara, and I've been using this every day, and there is still a little bit left in there, so I, I'm going to carry on until it runs out. I struggle to get to the end of a mascara. They seem to last 
forever. Just mental amount of time. So, yeah, I think I did pretty well. I've got a little bit left in that, a little bit left in that, and that's completely full, but it, it is only a travel size. And then I've got through all of that, plus my Dior makeup remover. So that's quite good. And I can now chuck these in the bin and they're out of my life. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. And please like and subscribe.